Bishop, how are you doing? And welcome to Conrad Stevenson's Paranormal PI. It's a very, it's a, it's a mouthful of a name, but it is a new ghost hunting game uh, that I've seen people play recently. I haven't seen anything about this game yet. I've heard it is a ghost hunting simulator more than a ghost hunt, than like a traditional ghost hunting game. So it's really about like what it would be like to be an actual ghost hunter instead of it being very focused on scary, scariness, ghost events, stuff like that. I'm excited to check it out. I wonder if it's gonna be like, I wonder what it's gonna be like. I hope you join me. If you're not subscribed, please do so. If you like the video, like, if you just like this like, but let's not waste any more time and let's hop into Paranormal PI. Let's do it. Oh, baby. I never thought I'd have my own office as a paranormal investigator. For years, I just did this for fun and rarely made any money doing it. I finally earned enough business to justify renting this place. And after several months, I think I got it looking somewhat professional. I also had my first customer visit in here the other day. I should look at the map in the back to get an idea of where I'm going to be investigating. What? It's, it's voice acted? Yeah, let me move chat real quick. Voice acting, excuse me. Interesting. It's not what I expected. I don't know what I was expecting, honestly. Alert, don't go on chat. All right, let's see. We have world navigation, uh, toggle the HUD on and off. That's with Q, okay. Uh, that's nice, so we can always look at this. Interact button, F, flashlights one, uh, cameras two, audio recorder three, EMF meter four, temp sensor five. So you have all the evidence in your inventory at all times. I actually really like this. This UI that you can just turn off and on the controls at any time. That's actually really smart. I like that. I've never seen that before in a game. It's cool. Um, we need to look at the map in the back. Is this the map? Uh, interact button. What do we got? Play in uh, press interact button to exit the map. Okay. Wait, there's so many places. Where do we want to go? Where are we right now? Does it say anywhere? There's a lot of places. Where do we want to go first? Um, lighthouse? I'm actually really curious. People have always said that they want to get... That they want to see a lighthouse map. Wait, top left house? We need to go somewhere? I, I People have always said that they want to see a lighthouse map in Phasmophobia. I want to check that out. Mouse inaccuracy? Oh, the mouse is not in the right spot. I'll, I'll get rid of that then. Um, here you go. No more mouse. Um... I don't know which map. I'm gonna go to small house. Let's go to this one at the bottom. Let's do that one. That looks small. Poik? Poik? Poik Street? Observed ghost? You have not been invited to investigate. Oh, I've not been invited to investigate this location. Am I invited to investigate anything? Okay, I've been invited to go to Evergreen Lane. Let's go there then, huh? Yes. Beep boop, beep boop. Beep boop, beep boop. The homeowners reached out to me a few days ago, seeming to be rather desperate for help. This family is convinced their house is haunted. They moved into the house oh. ago, and within the first few months, the wife heard odd sounds like footsteps coming from the upstairs as she was on the main floor. Her husband told her she was hearing things until he heard them himself. They have three children, and the two youngest informed mom earlier last week they have seen a young child playfully skipping through the upstairs hallway. Mom expressed her children feel they have a new playmate, but she does not share the same feeling. This is unsettling for the parents who want to get to the bottom of this. I'm sure I'll be able to find enough evidence to support their claims and put their minds at ease. This is interesting. Uh, let me, I think if I'm not gonna be using the HUD all the time, I think I'm gonna move you guys back up to normal place um, because I don't think the HUD is gonna be on most of the time. Yeah, cool. I have a flashlight. It's uh, dipping pretty low in terms of FPS, but maybe that's just the outside lighting. Ooh, interesting. I like the lighting style. This is a good. This is a good UI uh, like stuff. Everything being very clear on how to do it. What's going on here? We're in the building. Let's use our EMF. I mean, if anything is going to show, it's going to be the EMF right first. It said upstairs, right? He said that there were gonna be... That there were footsteps upstairs. I thought I did this in the dark. What? You thought you did this in the dark? I don't dark? need the lights on. I have a flashlight. Yeah, but I want the lights on. Wait, are you shaming me? Are you... <gasps> what the f... 
Hello? I thought this was... People said that this game wasn't scary. This and is here... usually more fun with the lights off. Are you... Are you shaming me into turning off the lights? <laughs> I'm being shamed. Let me play the game, you backseater. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, we got EMF. Wait, EMF 5? Bro, something's happening. This is usually more fun with the lights off. What are you saying, sir? Do you want me to turn off the lights down? You're acting funny. I should continue investigating. Are you fucking... Did Why I become is... afraid of the dark? I should turn this light off. Stop. Stop. Stop yelling at me to turn off. I can't turn off the lights. Okay, here we... Oh, my God, please. Please, please, just let me... Oh, my God, thank you. Please turn off the lights, because this guy won't shut the fuck up until I turn up. There you go, I did I it. You happy now? On. I have a flashlight. I don't understand this game. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> Why are you talking to me like this? There's no lights on anywhere. What's your problem? Is there a basement? There better be a basement. Oh my goodness, that's gotta be spooky. This is usually more fun with the lights All right, off. all right, this guy's really fucking you. <laughs> I'm gonna, okay, this light's still on. Turn it off. There you go, you happy now? I've turned all the lights off. Can you stop yelling at me? Thank you. There's a clothes on the ground. I like the idea, this is what I've been saying. I, I, I don't know if this is gonna be that game. But I've been saying that it would be really cool if there was a single player ghost hunting game like mo mostly focused on story and like exploring different locations. This might be that that kind of like idea. I've been saying that for a while that I would like to see a game like that. Like a ghost hunting kind of like Thief Simulator. Uh, let's see. I don't Oh. I had EMF5 there for a moment, you see? Okay, let's do a different type of thing. Uh, let's turn on the HUD. Take photos, space, night vision, X. This is usually more fun with the lights off. He said. You... Fun. I mean, I, I, I guess ghost hunting can be fun, but it's also... I mean, I'm used to ghosts wanting to kill me. I'm glad he shut up about the lights, though. <laughs> I don't see anything. Let's use a different tool. What's this? Um, This is audio recorder EVP session E. Select a question. Is there anyone here who would like to speak to me? Is there anyone here who would like to speak with me? Record, maybe? After I say I'm going that? to listen to that real quick. Is there anyone here who would like to speak with me? Nothing. <laughs> Do you know why I'm here? Well, I'm here all night. I guess I'll keep trying. Do you know why I'm here? I wonder if I recorded anything. Uh, me too. Do you know why I'm here? Nothing. I do. I don't mind Pretty the. Typical. No response. I mean, it's it might get really old to hear the same responses over and over again. Uh, but I do. It's it's a different style completely. A thermometer. Uh, how use. Uh, change units. Instantly change units. Don't give me those icky bicky freedom units. Those might as well not exist for me. Wait, now I can learn, though. Wait, now I can learn what... 20 degrees is 69? Nice. I want to have it 20 degrees everywhere. It's a little bit colder here. I think this is... Uh, from what I feel right now, I don't know. I, I have no idea. Maybe it's going to not have hunts and stuff like that. It's just more... More of a, like... Chill time? It's like over here a lot this is slightly colder like significantly colder if you consider i mean i love that it says pp industries on the thing by the way <laughs> pp industries anything happening okay have i seen all the tools what's this one okay that's a camera that's a recorder that's the emf that's this okay so that's all we got do we have any emf I, the, the the fact that I can't crouch is making me kind of... Oh! Even five! Wait, something's happening. Okay. Something the is EMF meter should not behave this way. This is paranormal. We got it! What do I do with that? <laughs> Jesus. 
Temperature data, EMF. My EMF reader has absolutely detected paranormal activity. Okay, so it instantly notes it down. Uh, how to investigate? Oh my god. That's a lot of text. Holy wall of text. Uh, Jesus Christ. Okay, special things, and that's it. Okay, that's it. So we found out you have, we are looking for a ghost on camera. Uh, we are asking questions with the audio recorder, basically. So this is, we are actively using it to see and take ghost photos. For the audio recorder, we're actively asking questions. It's not going to just passively work. Wait, I need to see more. Um, I need to, and then for the, the EMF we already used, the temp sensor we're using for very low temperatures, not for just any, any drop in temperature. And then flashlight, of course, is just flashlight. So yeah, it, it could have just been summed up in like three lines, but instead they did a whole thing. Anyway, that's fine. Um... What? Can I see anything about these ghosts? Oh my god. Um, <laughs> well, this is actually cool, though. This is, like, about the ghost. Um, ghostly information. Residual ghosts. Residual ghosts are spirits who act out a moment of their previous life, unaware of their surroundings, replaying events over and over. It is believed that, believed that these entities, being oblivious to their surroundings, do not inter intelligently interact with their environment. Somehow memories of their previous life, for whatever reason, has been imprinted out on the world. Paranormal investigators are under the impression that these were significant events of memories or memories of the spirit's previous life. It is a very perplexing phenomenon because these memories play at unpredictable moments with no correlation to the original event. Most haunted locations seem to be inhabited by residual ghosts. Most haunted locations. Interesting. Uh, cold spots and changes in electromagnetic field are common with these investigations. So freezing temperatures and uh emf we're like we're we're like actual it's like a real ghost hunting simulator where we're like learning the rules of the game as we go <laughs> this is it is interesting lots of text though but hey it's fine we're it's a different different type of game uh unexplainable sounds are usually witnessed also so unexplainable sounds in the earlier years of ghost hunting residual ghost photos were plentiful but they diminished the credibility of the field due to being poor quality fakes more recently, due to the improvements of ghost hunting technology, there have been a few there have been a few res residual ghost photos that have skeptics struggling to debunk. Like this. The photo of an apparent residual ghost was taken in 1896. This is credited as one of the first verifiable ghost photos taken. Okay. It could just be a guy sitting in the corner. I mean, just kidding. I'm just saying. Anyway. Uh, back to this. So, a residual will be replaying moments of its past. Before we go read the other ghosts, let's walk around if we can see anything. It was definitely doing stuff. Oh, an excite EMF. Interesting. I'm gonna excite EMF. Maybe we use one of these then? Let's ask a question. Uh, can you tell me your can name? Can you tell me your name? Give it to me. I wonder if I recorded anything. Me too. Can you tell me your name? Absolutely nothing. Sir Maximus, thank you for the 100 bitties. Jacksford, thank you for the four months. Solus, thank you for the seven months. No response. No response. Yeah, okay. Uh, let me turn up the audio. It's actually... Oh, I can't. Well, I can turn it up over... It's actually fine. I think it's just loud enough. Um, I don't see anything happening. Like, no nothing in the... Oh, you can also scroll through this. Let's uh, grab the thermo for a little bit. Oh, oops. Didn't mean to do that. Interactions are a bit janky. How do we turn this on again? S uh, space. I don't know why they have different buttons to to turn on the different equipment. That seems very annoying. <laughs> okay, the door. The doors are super stupid. Like I can only interact. What? I can like barely touch the doors. I have to be inside of the doors to touch them. Let's check downstairs. I was upstairs because the game said, like, at the start that they were her hearing voices upstairs. Let's go into the basement. <gasps> what the fuck? Is that a it's paranormal noise? What's going on, man? Hello? Oh, something in the basement. Oh, big EMF 5. EMF, check for this. Oh, big EMF, baby. It's a sports bike. That's not very ghostly. Any any more EMF? Oh, it's going wild over here. Let's do it. Let's do a question. I heard a beep. What does the beep mean? 
Is there anything you'd like to tell me? Here we go. Basement time? I wonder if I recorded anything. Yeah, me too. Just stop saying that. Is there anything you'd like to tell me? Fuck! Well, I'm here all yeah, night. Yeah, yeah, let's, I let me I'll do keep this. Trying. Let's do the thermo. This is, it's still mega active. 17, but that's just the basement, right? Okay, interesting. We're getting some stuff here for sure. I'm looking if there's press. I don't want to turn on the lights. Anything else here? This is a large basement you got here. Wait, it can open this door? No. Wait. No, yeah. <laughs> it's closed. Okay. More EMF? Still EMF over here? This is actually mega haunted. This place. This this one corner here is. Is it like an actual cold spot? Like, is it only here? It's the breaker? Why would the... Oh, the breaker gives EMF? Ah! Oh! <laughs> That's... I mean, I like that, actually. <laughs> that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> Interesting. So it goes off near... Oh, it goes off near electronic equipment. That's- I like that! I got jabated! I got bamboozled. <laughs> okay, I see. I mean, it's electromagnetic field, right? Makes sense, makes sense. I got bamboozled. <laughs> That's actually cool, I like that. Alright, um... We definitely had something, right? It, my character went like, Hey, we got EMF, but it was upstairs right here. I don't know... Like, maybe it's replaying a moment of its past over here, and it's like walking around. Let's look at the other ghost now that we have uh, walked around a little bit. Intelligent. That's creepy. A homeowner captured the shadow person peeking around the house in early 1959. Intelligent ghost. Intelligent ghosts are named so because they have the ca capacity to communicate and interact with the living. They, usually, they are usually ca categorized in two ways. The first category is of people who have passed away and are now spirits who mi myster mysteriously linger in our world. Most often, they are the inhabitants' loved, loved ones who have recently passed. In some cases, after a bit of research, it is determined that a deceased person had a strong connection to the location and now haunt it. In this case, it is some combination of the individual lived in the ho home. In this case, it is some combination of the individual lived in the home most their life or passed away suddenly within their home. Okay, sentence? What the fuck? In these cases, investigators have witnessed irregularities with both the EMF meter and the temperature sensor. Okay, so EM So wait, uh, the residual ghost has EMF, freezing, and voices, right? Sounds. And then this one has EMF temperature. On rare occasions, EVPs have been obtained after asking several questions. So this one is EVP... Like, EVP answers, the other one was just ghostly noises. Interesting. This type of intelligent ghost has been very elusive for photographers. The second category is a group often referred to as shadow people. Most paranormal investigators are under the impression that these entities left their life unfulfilled. This corresponds to their behaviors. In a rare number of cases, resolutions, resolution for the spirit has been identified and it disappeared. Like putting the old shoes back in the wall where they were found remodeling. They seem to interact with an EMF meter and a temperature sensor in almost a playful manner. Shadow people seem to be the most photogenic type of ghost. Investiga investigators usually have at least one solid photo within their portfolio. <laughs> Interesting. Okay, so that's for... So shadow people is photos, EMF, and temperature. And EVP. Uh, or di the different types. So you have EMF, temperature, EVP. So you always have EMF and temperature... And then you have either EVP or photos. Interesting. Cool. Is there anything? What's that? Oh, that's just... Is that me? No, that is just me walking around. Anything happening? Can I see something? I wonder if we're gonna get... What the fuck? My camera just shook. I wonder if we're gonna get shadow people. I wanna see some shadow people. This is a sl this is more of a slow pace. I didn't know that going into it, so that's why I'm, I'm very surprised. 
That it's gotta be slow pace. Yeah, this is just the television. It's the Fortnite default skin. Oh, baby. It's no, there's no cold spot or anything. Oh, wait a minute. It went super cold for a second here. That's a cold spot, right? Wait, it's like going away. Something is moving around. Something is moving around and it's causing the temperature to drop. Or the, the air came on? Turn off the breaker? Oh, if we turn off the breaker, then we get less EMF uh, shizzle. That's a good idea. If I can do that. I can't turn off the... Ooh, I can turn it on, though. Oh, no, that's just the light, isn't it? That's just the light. Wait. I don't need their lights on. Yeah, I yeah, yeah. Man, if you turn on any light, this guy goes, You need to turn off the light or I will not stop talking about the lights. I don't know why that's the thing. <laughs> Seems kind of dumb. Oh, it turned off because... It, like, has a 60-second window in which it records, and then it turns off for some reason. To save batteries, but then I turn it on immediately again, so it might as well just stay on. More doors in the basement? Yeah, those are blocked, though. I tried one before. I mean, I guess I didn't try all of them. Right over here, maybe? Uh, this one? Oh, this one does open. Okay. Anything creepy going on here? This is, it's, I, I don't mind a slow paced uh, game because there's only like so few locations, right? And then every time you go to a location, you have like a really long hunt. I, then they could go all in on like actually researching the past. Like, so you know where to go. Like this is just going to be EMF from the break. Usually paranormal investigations are done in the dark. I mean, I guess, I guess, I guess. Makes sense. Makes sense. What does the beep mean? Is that the thing turning off? Oh, it is. Okay. The doors are really annoying. I'm just looking around for some stuff. And I, I guess I, I could should use... actively collect my audio evidence. Oh, okay then. Do you know why I'm here? Is this your home? You could ask that. Let's play that back and have a listen. Do you know why I'm here? Try turning off your flashlight when using the camera. Okay, nothing. Maybe I should try again. Try walking around spamming questions. Let's use the camera for a moment. What the fuck? I thought I saw something. That's me. That's my footsteps, by the way, in case you're confused. I wish the camera was a bit larger. This is very, very tiny. Like, if you're a mobile user, you're probably like, what the fuck? There's just a black screen. <laughs> What's in the kitchen? Any mobile users in the chat? <laughs> I'm sorry. I can use it with a. I thought I saw shadow people for a moment. Yeah, I I like I like the idea of a slow pace, like more. Like, trying to be realistic ghost hunting game? That's very unique. That's something we haven't seen before. I like that it's trying to do something else. Uh, is this EMF of this, probably? Yeah. So we got EMF. We actually found an evidence already, which I think is impressive. I don't know if that's... I love that when I asked something, someone... When I asked if there were mobile users in the chat, the question gets answered two minutes later because mobile users have like crazy delay on the stream <laughs> it's, it's okay it's okay i love the mobile users <laughs> we love our mobile users <laughs> i'm a mobile user and i'm very offended you have like one second on mobile dude that's crazy i'm looking around for some time we haven't seen now i don't know if this means anything but we haven't seen any temperature drops so it might not be that. I would like, so the doors being so, the doors and the interactions are a bit clunky. Um, I don't, no more cold spots here. He didn't say anything about the, the, the temperature going down though. So it might just be random. Mobile goaded. True, true, true. 
Hey, it's Mario. Thank you for the three months. Is there no more cold spots? Let's read the rest of the ghosts. Poltergeist. Poltergeist. Here we go. Oh, floating items? The word poltergeist comes from the German language and means noisy spirit. Um, most research on these cases have found that activity started subtly and gradually increased over time, becoming intolerable by the homeowner. Sometimes these noises have no apparent source, and other times household items have been mysteriously destroyed. Some individuals who have experienced a poltergeist have claimed to be physically harmed by it. Although most evidence points to injuries being caused as a result from being startled and not intentionally by a ghost. Paranormal investigators are torn between two thoughts about the nature of poltergeists. The first being these ghosts are unknown life forms and not spirits of the deceased. This is, a substantiate, this is substantiated because there is quite often no correlate. There's quiet often. Sorry. Sorry to spell check you. Um, there's quite often no correlation to any former person the ghost could be. The second thought is that these ghosts were former people who are unhappy with the current residents. The supporting argument for this theory pertains to the nature of the disruptions, which are very human in nature. Both sites have supporting data, and only through detailed investigations can the facts be determined. These ghosts are extremely rare, and evidence is very elusive. Investigators have been able to obtain audio of these ghostly antics over the years. Generally, a temperature drop will occur prior to any activity. And then we have children toys are, toys are seen floating in the air, allegedly by a poltergeist. This photograph was taken midsummer of 1982. I know which room this photo was taken in. I can show you that room right now. Look, it's up here. It's this room. It's, it's literally this room. Oh my God. <laughs> I know, it's just... I know it just used as a generic room, but hey. Wait, is this a walk-in closet? There's like a door here. Oh, it is. It's a closet, not a walk-in closet. Yeah, aiming your, aiming your interactions is very hard. So we got EMF earlier here. I don't know if we should focus on one location. This is going to be a game. If it's very slow-paced, it's going to have a tough learning curve. Do more EVP. Uh, is this your is home? Is this your home? Let's play that back and have a listen. Is this your home? Nothing? Let's do one downstairs, because we've mostly done them upstairs. Well, I'm here all night. I guess I'll keep trying. Can I walk? Okay, I have to turn it off first. Um, let's do one in the living room. Uh, why are you here? Why are you here? Yeah, lousy go or noisy ghost. I'm going to listen right. to that real quick. Why are you here? You have to do that a lot, don't you? Pretty typical. Yeah, voice no response. There, there should be some cut in lines that happen way too often. I, I feel like once you've heard that a few times, you gotta cut out the, let's have a, let's play it back and have a listen. And you gotta cut out the, Typical, no response, because it's locking your care. I don't think I can move while I do this. Why are you here? Like, I'm locked. They, have, they really have to I'm make this listen more to fun. that real quick. Why are you here? I'm hearing nothing. Pretty typical, no response. Yeah, yeah, you say that every time. Okay, so nothing there. Let me check for some cold spots again. I wonder if we... I feel like we had some cold spot earlier, didn't we? Like some sometimes it went down to all the way down to 17, which I feel like is pretty significantly cold. That is a nice bathtub. Holy shit. I've never seen a bath this thick. That is the widest bathtub I've ever seen in my life. What the fuck? Like, never seen a bathtub that's not a jacuzzi this wide. That's crazy. Is this an American bathtub? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> <Got him. laughs> where, where did the sound go it's so quiet wait did the power go off wait the fridge stopped wait a minute is there evp is there emf still oh there is 
Is that shadow? No, that's not shadow. Beep, that's just the thermo going off. Imagine you like walking around and then all of a sudden you see like a shadow though. Like that's that's gonna be terrifying in this game. The power is off. But like why is it still giving e EMF then? I don't really understand. Doesn't is EMF not bound to electrical current flowing through things? I don't understand. Um As an American, if I could read chat, I would be offended. <laughs> nice. That's a gotcha right there. Oh. That spooked me. I thought there was something happening, but the fan just came back on. This is very... very I I mean, it's it, it's actually... I kind of like it. I, I We haven't really found anything besides the EMF. Let's look at the final ghost while we're we're just learning how to use the tools right. I think this is a game where I'm okay if people have experience with it. You can tell me some stuff, but let's read the let's read the final ghost. Demonic. Ooh. Oh, look at this. This photograph was taken in December of 1973. P priests perform an exorcism on a young girl supposedly possessed. She's literally floating, my guys. Demons are evil ghosts who are capable of terrible things. In general, these be these are beings who are never human and have been around for eons, migrate from location to location, preying on who they view as vulnerable. Research indicates the demon feeds on the fear and pain of others. With these types of haunts, homeowners can undergo psychological changes for the worst. It is as though the demon has inhabit inhabited the house as well as a resident within the home. Usually the distressed homeowner has observed negative changes from a member within the household. After an investigation has occurred, it is often concluded that these individuals are possessed. When a demonic entity has been determined to haunt a location, spiritual leaders of the homeowner's choice will get involved in an effort to cleanse the home and expunge the demon. The demons are rare, but their presence is known when they inhabit a home. The paranormal community has ex compiled some unsettling electronic voice phenomena EVP, over the years. Other than the EVPs and unexplained cold spots, evidence generated by other than the EVPs and unexplained cold spots, evidence generated by other type of equipment has been obscure. So it's cold spots and EVPs. And I don't think I mean, if it's a ghost hunting simulator, like the lore of this map was that the children had a play uh, like they were playing with the ghosts, right? So uh, they heard footsteps and the children were playing with the ghost. I don't think that's a demon. The main hint is in the journal in terms of ghost location. Oh! Wait, what? Most of the activity has been no witnessed upstairs. Probably not a poltergeist since you have EMF evidence. <laughs> okay, interesting. So most of the location is interesting. I didn't even see that it said something like that there. Okay, cool. Thank you. So it's upstairs. We got not a poltergeist. Let's do some uh, talking. Do you like the current family living here? Do you here? like the current family living here? I wonder if I recorded anything. Do you like the Why current family living here? Why can't kids be friends with demons? Don't they basically all have EVP? Pretty typical. No response. Uh, let me do the other one. Which one have we not done? Is there anything... How many people are here? How many here? people are here... Tiny blue Other zebra, thank you for the four months. Thank you. He kind of sort of. Let's play that back and have a listen. How many people are here other than me? I mean, is it really, really, really rare? Because I've tried well, here all night. I guess I'll keep trying. Uh, let's go through all of them. Is this is your this home? Is this your home? Can you tell me your name? Let's do that one. I'm going to listen to that real quick. Is this your home? I heard a step. What the fuck? Maybe I should try again. Uh oh. You heard a step? What the fuck? That actually kind of spooked me. <laughs> that was me, right? That's me. But I was standing still in the corridor. But that's this is my footsteps now. 
There's stuff on the ground. It's not a poltergeist. I honestly would say this feels like a residual because... I don't know. Based on the EMF activity, it seems to be walking around, right? Can you get more of the evidence? Like, it seemed like it was walking around. That's just the TV. Aha! The microwave. Someone hold me. I'm scared. It's kind of creepy. Let's stand over here. Wait! EMF 5! Just randomly? This is not electronics. What the fuck? Check temp? I was maybe too late. Let's check upstairs. Let's check everywhere. So this is like a significant... You see these like cold... Uh, there's gotta be cold spots, right? Hmm. These temp readings are unusual. Yes! See? I, I, I wish I could note that down earlier. Okay, so we have cold spots. Nice, let's go. These cold spots don't seem to make sense. I should continue investigating this. Nice, let's go. Okay, cool. I like that. So yeah, that's what we felt like it was before. It was going up and down, but we needed to confirm it and the guy needed to say it. So that's nice. Okay, more. Man, I would love to get a photo. That would be the... I'll keep that as audio evidence. I did it! I did it! I did it! Did, did, did it! Holy shit! Let's go! What the fuck? What's going on, man? Audio data. I've obtained some unusual sounds, which can't be explained. Let's go! <laughs> We're doing it, man. Okay. So wait, with that, we can actually. Oh, what does it say? Most of the activity has been witnessed upstairs. Probably not a poltergeist, since you have EMF evidence. Uh. Rarely does a shadow person make these type of noises. So it's an intelligent? Because dem demonic wouldn't make sense because the children were playing with the... Go Unless the children were playing with the de 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 demon. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, did you hear that? What the fuck? Did you I'm hear that? Record white noise and then spend hours listening to it. I was giggling. Seems like the noise has become too faint to record. What the fuck? Okay, this is actually terrifying. Dude, I love this game. This is really fun. <laughs> this is actually scary. I like this. Ooh, that is eerie audio evidence. Oh, that gave me chills, man! Oh, baby! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Dude, what the fuck? Seems like the noise has become too faint to record. Holy shit! What's happening? This ghost going crazy. I must actively catch video evidence. Yeah, 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 yeah. I do like that active part where you can't just, I don't know. I mean, I guess that makes sense. So there was just a whole bunch of creepy stuff. Oh, did you hear that? Well, I can take pictures all day, but nothing interesting to see. Man, I gotta, sh I gotta see them. This is real cool. This is Elisa. Yeah, this ghost is going fucking crazy. I'm gonna keep my flashlight on just so the mobile users have something to. Seems like the noise has become too faint to record. Bro, bro, this is not okay, man. You're you're chill with this. Nothing here worth recording. Nothing here worth recording. You're fucking absolute not. A, you're not an empath. Nothing here worth recording. You don't hear the demons? Are you fucking crazy? What? You don't hear these noises, Mister? Am I going crazy? What the fuck? Uh, 
I don't see anything worth taking a picture of. Oh. Oh. I hate this. I don't see anything. It's walking worth outside. A picture of. What is happening, man? Is it walking on the carpet? What's going on? There's so many noises. Jesus. If this game like throws a jump scare at me all of a sudden, I'm gonna cry. Wait. I'm not gonna press record then spend hours watching idols. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you for being an absolute piece of garbage. I thought there was a person. I like that if you have the door open, the outside noises can be heard. Okay, this is very creepy. Very, very creepy. Definitely have to make this small little screen a lot bigger. Like you have to have some kind of zoom in mode or something. Ask EVP questions. I don't think we have to do, maybe if we can get like an actual response. Is this your home? I wonder if I recorded anything. Is this your home? What the fuck? All right, I'll, um, yeah, we should try again. Let me, since, since this game really benefits from being heard, I'm going to increase the audio a lot. Like, a lot. <laughs> Maybe too much? Let's just... Is this your home? I'm going to listen to that real quick. Is this your home? That might be a bit too loud. <laughs> Not too loud. It's fine. That's good. Pretty typical. No response. Okay. You hear that? Dude, I feel like so invested now. This is this is changing like the whole. Ooh. There's so many noises. Please stop. Where? It sounds like it's outside. But the most activity was upstairs, right? Can it be... Can it, like, ditch the place? That would be so troll. I think it would still be upstairs. It sounded like it didn't come from upstairs. Turn off flashlight? Really, guys? You want to see... I mean... Bro, bro, this ghost is going fucking wild. There are too many noises. Investigating with the camera recording all night results in hours of post-investigation work. Bro, what the fuck, man? Too much. It's too much! Leave me alone! Holy shit, this game gets in your head, man. What is this happening? Is it downstairs? Can I, I like spam anything it? We're taking a picture of. Well, I can take pictures all day. But oh no, is it gonna keep see. saying it now for a while? Oh no, I try. Of. Okay, thank you. I'm not quite sure about this. Can is there like um, you have to do it? What the fuck? I don't know how this would look like. Like I have no idea what I'm looking for. Take another temper. Term this is a clock. Is the laptop gonna give EMF? My my immersion would be insane. No, the laptop is not giving EMF. Immersion ruined. Oh, here. 
Is this your home? Stuff, stuff is Let's off. Everything is whistle. off. The TV is also off. Is this your home? Fuck. Pretty typical. No response. Check the bedroom at the end of the hall. There were like orb. Why are you here? I'm going to listen to that real quick. Why are you here? Nothing. Da, 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 da. Well, I'm here all night. I guess I'll keep trying. Hmm. As soon as I hear a noise, I'll press record. Yeah. I don't hear anything worth recording. Who is that? I'm glad I captured it with a recorder. Bro, what the fuck? This ghost has gone from nothing to absolutely terrifying mode. I need to open this. So I guess this is just it. Audio data is just this. I don't think it's going to get more like this. The main thing that I need is the ghost photo. Ghost photo? What? Ah! Investigating with the camera recording all night results in hours of post investigation. Oh boy. I'm not going to press record. Yeah, shut the fuck up. Stop talking to me. Dude, this might actually be a demon. This is fucking terrifying. It's so freaky. I don't know. Like, I don't know what I'm looking for in terms of ghost photo. Like, it might be very obvious. Or, I mean, if, if it's like any other ghost photo that people have shown, like, 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 uh, in, like, real-life ghost evidence, it's always, like, super janky. <laughs> I have no idea. You will see it? Uh-oh. <laughs> I don't like the sound of that psycho. Uh-oh. We will see it, guys. We can't miss it. Yeah, the... They definitely the man the shaking as well in the camera mode. You know what? I have a I have a fix for this. We have a forewarned fix for this. So here we go. We make it like that, and then we go. Brrrm. Here it is. This is it. There. Now you guys get zoomed in vision. Here you go. That's it. Ah! Wow. I, I took a photo of a ghost. Multiple ghost photos in one night. Amazing. Oh, that was a good idea! That was a good idea! <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, it worked! <laughs> Sorry, it's so shaky. I can't help it. Well then! Jeebus! Okay, I'm gonna have to turn this off for a second now. What did we get? Base of the activity... Has most of the activity has been witnessed upstairs based on the photo obtained. This is definitely a residual ghost. We got it. We did it. That was so fun. Look at us go. Boom. Can I fill it in? Finalized investigation. We got we do it. That was so creepy. Head to the truck. Uh back to the truck. Head to the back of your truck to compile your report. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Get the fuck out of here. This place is creepy as shit. They're literally screaming. What the fuck, man? This game is messed up. Oh, I can't go here. Hello? Help? Lag? Is my truck over here? Where's my truck? Is my truck over here somewhere? There it is. Jeebus. That was really fun. It's like the back of the truck. Wait, do I have to file the... I guess I do it this way? Residual. There you go! We got an achievement and everything. Man, they really... Can I turn on dark mode in this game? Because holy fuck, why is everything so white? Why is everything like... My eyeballs. We think we got 100%. Look at us go. 
The client stated they have witnessed paranormal activity around the upstairs hallway in the form of an apparition as well as hearing footsteps from the same area. They, they want to understand what they are experiencing and ensure their family is safe living in the house. EMF evidence. The, electron the EMF meter located several field spikes through the investigation. This was evaluated substantially and was determined to be paranormal. Since more sus substantial forms of evidence was collected, this supports the theory that the ghost absorbs and consumes EMFs to generate energy, resulting in greater interactions with the environment. Temperature evidence. The temperature sensor produced some unusual readings sporadically during the course of the investigations or investigation. Due to other data being collected, it is reasonable to conclude that this was related to paranormal activity. Uh, photo evidence. The full body apparition obtained on camera solidifies interact the paranormal activity at the residence. This also corroborates the claims made by the cl children's, the client's children. Because the photo is of the same entity they witnessed, man. My eyes are hurting from this. Audio evidence. Strange noises which sound like footsteps were recorded during the investigations. These noises seem to originate from the hallway upstairs. This aligns with what the children have experienced. Closing summary. CSPPI obtained conclusive evidence on the above mentioned devices, supporting the fact this residence is haunted. Although substantial paranormal activity has been found within the home, there's no reason for concern. This appears to be a residual ghost. Residual ghosts are spirits who act out a moment of their previous life, unaware of their surroundings, replaying the same event over and over. Through previous research, it seems like these entities, being oblivious to their surroundings, do not intelligently interact with the environment. That's such a weird sentence. Somehow the memory of their previous life, for whatever reason, has been imprinted on the world and plays at unpredictable moments. The activity will probably continue at various intensities, but is completely harmless. If there are further concerns, CSPPI will return to the residence for a follow-up investigation. Cool. Cool stuff. We did it. Gosh, damn. That was creepy. Let's do another one. That was a lot of fun. Let's check out another one. Uh, the game. Let me go to the main menu and see if I can turn down. In terms of... I, I need to turn down the FPS or something. Because I see my camera sometimes gets like the, like kind of delayed. There might be slight decent. <laughs> Uh, let me turn this down to 60 FPS. Hopefully, yeah, that fixes a lot. Let's continue. Yeah, they need to run through. There's a lot. Okay, so, so far, very creepy. Very creepy. Love the style. Love the long form story mode style where you're like doing a mission that's been laid out for you there i hope there's gonna be different noises and different creepy stuff in the different houses like it's gonna be unique every time that's a lot of fun i love the story aspect but then the um the 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 voice lines repeating a lot when it's unnecessary is kind of annoying the um the um the camera is way too small. Like, you would love to see a lot more on the camera and it not being this tiny little screen. Uh, and then on top of that, also the text is kind of janky sometimes. Like, there's gra grammatical mistakes in the text. or And it's just way too much text as well. And the white. Everything is so white and bright on the menus. Please make a dark mode instead. Okay, next one. Uh, we're gonna go here. This, you have not been... Okay, not there. Not there. I'm just gonna... I don't know if they said anything. Like, do I know? Do I know which one I've been investigated or, like, invited to? I don't know. I'm just gonna click on them all. Oh, there's only one place? Oh, I can't wait. No, really? It's... I mean, it. it's really early access, I guess. Is there gonna... Oh, wait. So there's only one? Or is there two houses? Only one house, but you can place with different ghosts. Okay, no, that's fine. Different ghosts. Different ghosts. So only one house for now, but different ghosts. That's fine. I don't mind that. Like, I, I the house is new to me anyway. If there's different ghosts, I I'm totally fine. I a call a few days back from the homeowners who believe their house is haunted. The only they two? Oh, there are two? Someone or something out of the corner of their eye, which okay. disappears about as quickly well, well, as we'll it check appears. this. Let's, let's go like to... Let's go to... What the... Oh, sure. I quit the whole game. Um... I want to check the other house. If there's a, another house, I want to go there first. Man, I have a slight bloody nose. Oops. I don't know how that... Polk Street? Is that the other one? That's the one I visited. Where's the other one? 
It's unlocked after the mission? You have to finish... Oh, you have to finish all of the first house missions first. Okay, that's totally fine. Totally fine. Sorry. Uh, it's only this house until you finish the missions, and then the next house. I like this. And I especially with so many locations planned the for the future. Who believe their house is haunted. They catch a glimpse of someone or something out of the corner of their eye, which disappears about as quickly as it appears. It seems like the entire family has noticed this at one time or another. They stated seeing this figure throughout their house, primarily as the family is watching television. It'll enter their peripheral vision from another room. Initially, they didn't believe what they were seeing, but soon became convinced when everyone was witnessing the same thing. At first, this was very startling for them, but now they are more curious, if anything. They want to understand what they are seeing. I'm sure I'll be able to find enough evidence to support their claims and put their minds at ease. Oh, alrighty. Let's go. I'm excited. This is lots of fun. I like the... Because this makes it... Like, for... I think this is great for an indie game like this, because all of the ghost hunting games so far... Lights on. I yeah, have yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Did all I become of, afraid of the dark? Oh, I my God. He off. spams it so hard. Jesus Christ. Um, Because all of the ghost hunting games so far have done kind of the same thing as Phasmo, which is where it's a mission, and the ghosts are different every time, but you replay the same mission over and over and over again. And as I said, like, as I said previously, I love the idea of a story game where you get, like, a good 30 hours or maybe less, maybe just 10, 20 hours of, like, curated, creepy missions, and then you're completely done with the game. That's totally fine. 20 hours of a lot of fun ghost hunting is a great experience in my book. That's, that's like, that's a lot of fun. Like, I don't mind it being, like, not replayable if it's a lot of creepy for, like... Kind of like Prognostic. Yeah, basically. Like Prognostic. I want to check out Prognostic again, by the way. The family has seen a figure on the main floor of the house. I thought it was at the TV. Is there another TV? Do these people have two TVs? Kind of rich... Rich people? Yeah, they do. Look at you go. Ooh. So in the corner of their eyes... Okay, let's ask Maybe I should find some evidence before I start talking to the air. Okay, interesting. It doesn't even want to... I like that, that it doesn't allow me to do that until we get something, at least. There was some EMF. So there's EMF here because it's a television? Okay, let's get some EMF, potentially. Yeah, the journal's like... Ah! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Flashing lights, literally. We have five TVs? Gosh dang. Oh! Something? Is that this? Wait, is this? What is this? Wait. I guess that's just the the the, the refrigerator. Oh, the power plug? Oh, the power plug. Wait, interesting. I like these. Yeah, they give different... That's fun. I like it. Okay, give me, um... Give me some EMF, please. Some EMFers, maybe some thermo readings. That's why does it default back to f fuck units? <laughs> I'm sorry. Give me C all the time. Champion units. Oh, cold. Come on. I saw some, there was some low stuff. Here, corner? I'm getting a cold spot in the corner. Is that because... There's definitely something. It's going up and down. More, 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 more. Maybe in the... from the, they It entered from different rooms, right? It, they said maybe... <laughs> What the fuck, man? It just comes out of nowhere. Why do you do this to me? Holy shit. Because the vents are on the floor? Are you serious? Is it, is it that realistic? Are you fucking serious? The vents are colder? Okay, I love that. <laughs> I mean, it makes sense. But like, at the same time, what the fuck, man? <laughs> That's cool. 
Okay, so the vent, I'm getting debated by the vents. More, more, more. Give me something. Give me some activity. Let's hold some EMF out. I'm gonna sit at the television. I'm expecting EMF to like randomly appear here. It seems like it's gonna wind up slowly throughout the. <gasps> Is that something? But that was like an EMF five out of nowhere, with nothing nearby to cause it. That was definitely something, Mister. Are you not gonna talk about that? That gave me a five come out of nowhere. And there's nothing electronic nearby, so that must have been the ghost. We're not gonna get the ghost photo as first evidence, right? That seems crazy. Interesting. Thermal? Some thermal readings, potentially? Uh, hmm. These temp readings are unusual. It's so cold! He got out of 15 all of a sudden! Let's go, we got it! Let's talk? As soon as I hear yeah, a yeah, noise, yeah, yeah, shut up. I'll press record. Is this your home? I wonder if I recorded anything. Is this your home? Maybe I should try again. Maybe. EMF. I'm, I'm sticking to the TV. Or like around the TV room because that's where they said they saw it most of the time. Okay, some more stuff. Talk. Why are you Why here? Why are you here? Beep. Let's play that back and have a listen. Why are you here? It was from the other room. That is true. Maybe I should try again. That is true. Maybe this room? Because this room is next to the television. It's the bathroom. Okay, let's try. Do you like the current family living here? I wonder if I recorded anything. Oh, it turned on the fan. Do you oh, like the current stupid. family living here? Nothing yet. And the ghost kill you. I don't Maybe know. I don't cool. think no if it's gonna go for realistic ghost hunting, I don't think there's a way to die. Because have you ever heard of someone just fucking dying on a ghost hunt? <laughs> I don't think that really happens. <laughs> yes. Yes. Nuke stop five. I died. I literally died. No clickbait. I don't think so. <laughs> Imagine. Okay, so it was cold there. From the corner of their eye, this would be a pretty... Oh, it went down again. Eh, there's definitely something here. Let's talk. How many people are here other than me? I would expect the shadow, right? Let's play that back and have a listen. How many people are here other than me? 20 people. It's, it's a whole party. I Maybe know. I should try again. How many people are here other Oops. than me? <laughs> I literally tried. Spacebar also confirms the question. Let's play that back and have a listen. How many people are here other than me? Nothing. Come on, man. Yeah, yeah. Pretty typical. No, no response. response. So that seems... I think it, like, very much... Oop, the beep. It very much ramps up slowly, but then eventually it started going wild. Like, there were sounds all the time happening. Like... I'm standing over here just to emulate... Like, uh... Let's stand over here. Let's be the. Let's be the TV watchers and see if we can find anything unusual. Yeah, it's not very high quality because I've made it super large. 
orbs. Dots. I'm not seeing anything. I would imagine the ghost photo takes the longest. Can it hunt? I, I, I don't imagine. I'm not sure. I don't know. Again, I'm just playing this completely blind. I don't know anything about it besides what I've played so far. Let's uh, go back to normal for a second. Look how small that is compared to what I did. Any EMF, please? Any EMFers? This is actually nice. I can't go in the shower. Can't take a shower. This... What the... Is this? <laughs> All right, give me some EMF. Do it. Millie Gauss. Oh no, it's EMF three. Oh my god. Give me something. We already know that about the temperatures, but we did. So I guess it's just kind of like done now. I think EMF is like the best next one to do. Do you know why I'm here? Wonder if I recorded anything. Do you know why I'm here? <laughs> well, I'm here all night. I guess I'll keep trying. Sir. That's... Oh my God, it's so bright. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Give me some EMF, please. Corner of your eye could also very much be you're sitting here and then this room. This room? This room is much more likely to be the corner of your eye than that room. Because this room, you're like looking straight at it, right? That's not necessarily the corner of your eye. This could be, this could be the room. Oh wait, it all connects, Never mind. What is this open plan? Just walking around, just seeing if there's any EMF. Maybe, maybe it's a poltergeist. Poltergeist didn't have EMF, right? That's what they said. Yeah, we're gonna sit on the couch. Sit on this couch, maybe? I mean, I would say like this, this one. And we're gonna look at. We're gonna ask some questions. Uh, is there anything? Is there you would... anything you'd like to tell me? I'm going to listen to that real quick. Is there anything you'd like to tell me? Remix, thank you for the two months. Try Fox, thank you for the seven months. Well, Namasai, I'm here all night. Thank you for the five I guess months. I'll keep trying. And to be your demon with the six months as well. And Salty Chim with the seven. Thank you guys. Can you tell me your name? Let's play that back and have a listen. Can you tell me your name? Come on! Thems are easy to find. We Maybe already I got Thems. try again. All right. More, um, more EMF, please. So quiet. I'm at the television. I would like some EMF Python. Thank you for the five months. That's just this. I like that you have to be careful where you're like pointing it so it's not gonna spike randomly on stuff that doesn't relate to ghost activity. Oh, wait, that's just the fucking fridge. I got baited by the fridge. EMF is coming from inside. Inside the house. Come on, man. So quiet when the fan turns off. It's creepy. It's not gonna be upstairs. What? I don't know which. What would be like the strategy here? Maybe find. I don't know if it's like Phasmo where you like find the ghost with like temperature. Something is going on here. These temperature readings are definitely paranormal. Okay. 
So the cold spots is definitely again over here, right? Oh, that's just a fucking fridge again. Wait, no, that wasn't the fridge. Yes, that's so annoying. That wasn't the fridge. Like, for sure not, right? There's no... You see those EMF-5? These it lights are acting funny. I should continue investigating. There you go! Fuck yes! There you go! Nice! I have detected some unusual activity with my EMF meter. Let's go! The family has seen a figure on the main floor of the house. Although you have paranormal evidence from your temperature sensor, this does not help you narrow it down to the ghost... Uh, to the type of the ghost present. Okay. Cool, though. We got that. Next one. Do you like the current family living here? I'm going to listen to that real quick. Do you like the current family living here? We'd love to hear some responses here. Maybe I should try again. Voice acting is cool. They just need to tune down a few of the lines. Beep. Uh, why are you here? Why are you here? Happy little ghost activities, yeah. I wonder if I recorded anything. Why is there no are you French question? Why are you here? Unacceptable. Pretty typical. No, no response. response. French ghost, please. Ask if the ghost is French. Come on now. Is there anyone here who would like to speak with me? Are you pizza? I'm going to listen to that real quick. Is there anyone here who would like to speak with me? To speak to me. Well, I'm yeah. here all night. I guess I'll keep trying. What's this, by the way? There's, someone was just cutting a tomato and then left, like, in... Who the fuck does this? Who just leaves a cut, uneaten tomato? This to... Wait. He ate part of the tomato. Who does this? That's that's some crazy stuff. That's insane over stuff. There gonna be more. Oh, there's cold readings. It's definitely here, right? Here's where we get all the stuff. I don't hear anything worth recording. I did! Nothing here worth recording. Are you fucking mad? I don't hear anything worth recording. Slam your head on the fridge! Sorry, I'm a little angry with this guy. I should actively collect my audio evidence. Just leaving the recorder on makes oh my for a God, lot you're of post fucked. investigation. You're so work. fucked. You're, f you're a piece of garbage. You're out here being the chillest. You're out here being so chill when I'm just it. shitting my panties. I should actively collect my audio evidence. Why are you here? I'm going to listen to that real quick. Why are you here? Come on, man. Pretty typical. No response. Uh, is this your is home? This your home? I wonder if I recorded anything. Is this your home? You have to turn off your flashlight? No. Maybe I should try again. Um, okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Shouldn't have clicked that. Let's look at the cam again. Turn off the flashlight. Let's look at the cam for a little bit. Zooming in. Go full screen if you dare. If you're a real gamer, you go full screen right now. I double dare you. <laughs> Caught in four hundred forty-four p. Gamer moment. <laughs> full screen engage. Thirty-four <laughs> inches curved screen filled. Let's go. I, I'm expecting something from the corner of my eye, maybe there. 
Maybe like this? Unless it's up the stairs. Boom. That was just a clock, though. Unless it comes from the corner of the room. Sorry for the shaking. I just can't help that. That's what the character does. I guess it's not that bad because it's only... Yeah, it actually only, like, shakes the camera... I should actively collect my audio evidence. Is this your home? I hate this guy. I'm going to listen to that real quick. I want to fucking kill this guy. Is man. this your home? My screen is still black. That's because I'm in the dark. Well, I'm here all night. Dude. I guess I'll keep trying. <sighs> it, it, it's because I'm in the dark, guys. Oh, you, you have home? the screen. Well, I'm in the dark anyway. You mean this. That's what you mean. wonder if I recorded this, anything. I mean, if you want, you want to see the questions. Is this your home? Well, I'm here all night. I guess I'll keep trying. Wait, what? I thought I saw something for a second. Hello? Dude, the fact that it's like screaming at me and yet this guy is like, I can't hear anything. What the fuck? I'm not gonna record something that I don't hear. Ah, la la. La 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 la. Fuck you. Once I see a ghost, I'll snap a picture. I think it turns off. Okay, we can hear it even better now. Talk. Is this your home? I wonder if I recorded anything. Is this your home? All right, we're just going to go through every question from the top. Pretty typical. No response. Boom. Is there anyone here who would like to speak with me? I bet you missed the voodoo doll now. <laughs> Let's play that back and have a listen. Is there anyone here who would like to speak with me? So we should probably do this where we heard the where we got the other stuff, right? Pretty typical. No response. We got all our evidence in this this spot. So we should ask them here. Do you know why I'm here? Let's play that back and have a listen. No, there's a door. Just think of the sub. Can you talk back? Well, I'm here all night. I guess I'll keep trying. You need more EMF? I mean, I got some readings in this. Like, it's just tingling a lingles. Just some casual tingle lingles. Nothing, nothing out of the ordinary. This ghost took me forever to do something. I mean, it's kind of meant to be like that. Whoa, 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 whoa. That was definitely uh, out of the ordinary. You did not see that, sir? You did not see the EMF? Dude, it's going fucking maniac mode. The EMF meter should not behave this way. This just is just getting warmed up achievement. Just leaving the recorder on makes for a lot of post investigation work. Ah! Are you fucked? Do you like the current family living here? Are you fucking Let's play insane? That back and have a listen. Do you like the current family outside noise? Here? Are your neighbors going? <laughs> Maybe I should try again. Not my neighbors. <laughs> yes. Oh. Is this your <laughs> home? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to listen to that real quick. Is this your home? <laughs> Sounds like my neighbor's stuff. Pretty typical. No, no response. response. You don't live in you America. Know why I'm here. Come on, give it to me. Let's play that back and have a listen. Do you know why I'm here? I don't know if it's actually Maybe meaning to say again. that it's like not this. Do you I like guess the it's not the ghost sound. Here? 
sounds so creepy. Let's play that back and have a listen. Come on. Do you like the current family living here? No, it's definitely not in the basement because that's where they said it should be on the main floor. Maybe I should try again. Um, okay. So this doesn't really do anything for us now. Maybe look at the cam for a little bit. I'm looking at the area where it happened, right? Those are fucking demon noises, bro. Those are not neighbors. Why are you here? Those are crazy noises. Why are you here? Disembodied horse sounds. Well, I'm here all night. I guess I'll keep trying. More. More. Can you tell me your name? Demonic neighbors. I'm going into this room. I'm going to listen to that real quick. Can you tell me your name? Yeah, this ghost is being very quiet. Like, it's just a very shy ghost. Maybe I should try again. I mean, it is, I guess it's just, uh, that's just an ambient noise. I can't get used to that, though. Um, okay, so we're not really getting anything. I don't know if it's because we just, we just have to be patient, which I think that is the reason. We just, we just have to be patient. Um, here you go. Cold stuff. I'm not gonna record white noise and then spend hours that, to That's it. fucking crazy noise. Crazy noise. And you're here out here just chilling the fuck out. It's so cold here. What the fuck? Dude, it's so cold. I don't think we need any more, but I mean, I'm not getting anything else. I might as well. Feel like I'm doing something. It was all the way down to 15, and this guy's just like, nope, that's nothing. Talk to me! Talk to me about the cold spots, you little shit! Talk to me, baby. Oh, you turn it off? Okay, then. Little rude. Open my book. <laughs> Uh, probably not a poltergeist since you have EMF. It says something different now. Based on how and when I am seeing meter spikes, I am convinced that there is paranormal activity here. Um, okay. Sure. But I can see myself. I can see the EMF. Ah! What the fuck? Dude, are you sh fucking pulling? What is going on? Did this door just open? I don't think I opened this door. What? Oh. Oh my goodness. I'm so spooked going in the basement. Uh oh. If the door fucking opened. Isn't that, like, something mega special? Shouldn't we note that down? Like, isn't that pol- That can't be poltergeist, though. But that's some crazy activity, man. It's just the wind. Let's ask a question down here. Is this your home? Fingerprints? Let's play that back and have a listen. Is this your home? No. Maybe I should try again. Did the door open in my face? Did anyone see the door open? It must have opened because I definitely didn't have this open. That's actually fucked up. Can you tell me your name? It was instant. Man. That's creepy. I'm going to listen to that real quick. Can you tell me your name? Hey, Kate, what's up? 
pretty typical. No, no response. response. Okay, Jesus. I need to calm down. That's like the small, like a door touch. <laughs> Amazing. I took a picture of a ghost. Another piece of photographic evidence. What? How can you be that chill, bro? I'm pooping my pants. <laughs> Holy fuck. <laughs> Help! <laughs> this is crazy! Holy shit, man! Oh, shadow person! Whew. Based on the photo obtained, this is definitely an intelligent ghost in the form of a shadow person. We did it! Jesus Christmas, man! This game is seriously terrifying! We did it! We actually got it! Holy fuck. <laughs> that was so cool. My goodness. This guy is insane. <laughs> uh -oh. Let's go. We did it, right? Boom. 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 Look at that. 100, 100. And then the other one we definitely didn't find. Like, there was just no audio. Look at that. Bam. Closing summary. Obtain conclusive evidence on the above mentioned devices supporting the fact that this res that this residence is haunted. Although substantial paranormal activity has been found within the home, there's no reason for concern. No reason for concern. This appears to be an intelligent ghost in the form of a shadow person. Based on the years of research, CSPPI is under the impression that the living form of this ghost was unfulfilled when it passed away. Perhaps learning some history about the house may shed some light on this subject. In a rare number of cases, investigators have identified resolution for the spirit, and it disappeared. Like putting the old shoes back in the wall where you found them remodeling. If there are further concerns, CSPPI will return to the residence for a follow-up investigation. Holy fuck! That was crazy. That was so good. That was so spooky. I actually think I would I would love to play more of this game. I really want to check this out again. What a creepy. There's more to do, right? There's like a, a de second house as well. I really want to check that out. I think this is like a perfect spot to end the first episode. Man, this is cool. Let me know if you want to see more. I, I this game like blew me away. What a cool game. What a cool experience. Uh, this is, again, not the best name. There's a few things. That the name, Conrad Stevenson's Paranormal PI. It could just be Paranormal PI. I, I, I'm not trying to shit on if the person name that made the game is Conrad Stevens. But, like, it's not the most searchable title of a game. Uh, this The menus are, like, blastingly white. Maybe to put a dark mode on there. Then you have the camera being way too small. The voice lines sometimes being overused. Like, cut some of the voice lines so it's just him asking a question and then listening back instead of him going, I should listen back to that. And also, like, that moment right there genuinely was absolutely horrifying when the ghost showed up, screamed at me, and then the guy goes, Oh, this splendid. I found myself a ghost. How convenient. Let's get out of here. It's like so jarring like it feels weird it feels weird like i can still be scared myself but the fact that this guy is so apathetic and doesn't give a shit it it kind of takes it away in a weird way i mean i just gonna still be scared but like it's so weird i should probably just not do that i don't know anyway this was awesome let me know what you thought uh i can't wait to play more a story game ghost hunting is what i've been wanting for a while so i hope this one continues to grow into that continues to update like improve things and add more creepy stuff this is awesome yeah i can't wait to see more hope you enjoyed the video if you're not subscribed please do so if you like the video like it if you dislike it, dislike it if you want to join the love the game is here in chat you can join us over at twitch.tv slash insim every single day at 7 p.m central you being that thank you very much for watching i love you and i'll see you in the next one bye bye guys bye bye that was sick